guys i hope you're all having a lovely day it's beautiful sunshine here once again so that makes me happy i have a little lush haul to share with you these were actually sent to me from the lush press office ahead of the products being released in store on october 15th if you've been to the website you would have seen the 16 secret new products promotion um they have launched as it says, 16 secret new products um, that you can kind of go around the website and try and find. It's really quite a cool little idea. Uh, the products that they have released from the looks on the website, I looked on the website, and the uh, press release that I received, they're really exciting. They've released some new soaps, some new bath melts, some new kind of bath um, bombs and bubble bars and things like that, uh, body stuff, stuff for your hair. They've released some really cool stuff uh, for the autumn, winter season. I have a couple of things to share with you. So um, yeah, as I said, these are not available in Lush stores until October the 15th, but you can get them online at lush.co.uk. So if you see anything you like, you can go over there and they will be available um, there. The first thing I will share with you is a bath lipstick. I think these are gorgeous. These are so pretty. And uh, every time I shop at Lush, uh, I don't have one near me, so I usually shop online. I'm always umming and ahhing over which bath products to get. Um, I really like their bath stuff. I like all the Lush stuff. But uh, yeah, they're, they're so pretty. They do so many pretty things. And uh, this one is the new one. This is Phoenix Rising Bath Ballistic. Really, really pretty. And this one is, it says it's $2.95. So £2.95, which I think is pretty reasonable. It's so pretty as well. So, so pretty. It's, uh, yeah, it's bright purple with some glitz, um, gold glitter in it. Well, not, not glitter, gold shimmer. And it has a little cinnamon stick on the top. This is just beautiful. Like, it's huge as well. It's absolutely huge. Um, what you do with this, as you probably know if you're a big bath ballistic fan, you drop this in the bath and it's supposed to like swirl around and kind of bob about and release all these beautiful colours and patterns and bubbles. So, um, yeah, I, I just think this is so cute. I haven't actually used it yet because obviously I wanted to show you. So the scent of this is amazing. It reminds me of Christmas. Like, it's just such a typical Christmas scent. It's unbelievable. It just reminds me of Christmas Day. It smells like cinnamon. It has a little cinnamon um, stick in the top. I was reading about this and kind of where the inspiration at Lush came from to make the Phoenix Rising Bath Ballistic and um, it kind of came from um, their new website, they've launched their new website again, um, if you follow Lush you would already have known that and uh, they, while they were making the new website they decided to call it the Phoenix, um, kind of like as a placeholder and uh, this one kind of came about with the cinnamon stick and everything because um, in the, you know, in, in mythology that is what the phoenix made her nest out of. She made it out of cinnamon sticks. So I just think that is such a cool idea. I love it. It smells amazing. It's really, really strong. Like, really strong. Quite masculine, but very much reminds, reminds me of Christmas. There's just not really actually anything else you can say about it. It's a really Christmassy scent. It's really strong, really heady, but really nice. A couple of other bath things. These are so cute. These are new. Um, they've released three different variations of them. I have two of them. They are called bubble runes, and uh, they're called that way because they are bubble bars, but they are actually in the shape of macaroons. So I think that's really cute. I have the rose jam bubble rune. These are £3.50. Um, you get two of them though, so I think that's a pretty good deal. Um, and they look like this. They look like this. So they come like this. They're so cute. They're so cute. This smells amazing. This is so strong. Um, so if you really like rose scents, which I actually do, I love rose. Um, this actually reminds me a little bit of the Champneys, um, I think it's the Central Rose Shower Gel they do. Really true rose scent. If you, But it, um, obviously because, I mean, it says it's rose jam. It does... It smells a little bit like jam. It's very strange. It's a really, really strange scent, but it's so nice. It's a really comforting scent. And what you do is you just crumble these into your bath. So you can actually, they come apart. So you can actually just use one. Um, I've been using the other one that I haven't showed you yet. I've been crumbling that into, into my um, water and it's just beautiful. It makes it this beautiful, um, like sherbetty color, lots of bubbles and the scent is amazing. So this one smells like rose. This is one of their bubble rooms, bubble bars. I just think they're adorable. They're so cute. Um, and then another bubble rune I have is the yuzu and cocoa bubble rune, which is really, really unusual scent. Um, a yuzu, I did not know what yuzu was. A yuzu is a Japanese mandarin, so there you go. Um, and this is pretty much the same deal. It's the same deal. Looks like this. <laughs> so cute. Kind of looks like Play-Doh. 
just like plain This smells amazing. It does smell like cocoa, but it also smells like orange, and it's the it's it's like a chocolate orange. There you go. It's the weirdest scent in the world, but it's so pleasing. And I've got um, a couple more of these, so I've been using that one in my water, and it's amazing. It makes the water go sherbetty orange, and the smell is amazing. Now, I don't know if they do a perfume for this, but they definitely should. Oh my god, so nice. Once again, really reminds me of Christmas and Terry's chocolate orange. So. If you like Terry's Chocolate Orange, you'll probably really like this. And the price of that, as I said, I believe I said it's three fifty for these two. So that's kind of cool, and you just crumble a bit. You don't have to use the whole thing. I haven't been using the whole thing. I've just been crumbling a little bit into my water from um, the other one that I've got, and it goes a huge way. So those are the bath things, and I have two more things that are new out of the products they've just released. The first one is this, and I have it on my lips today. Okay, Lush Lip Tint and Latte. It looks like this. These, oh, these are lovely. I don't know if they do any more of these. I don't know, but they really should. They're, they're just so nice, you just want to eat them. This actually does smell like coffee. It's actually got coffee bean in it and vanilla extract. It's very nice, very, very nice. So this is what this looks like. You get 10 grams of this, which is a huge amount. This is, I've got it up here somewhere. Oh, I'll put the prices down below. I've changed the page. I'll put the prices down below for this. I think this is about fiver. But um, it's so pretty. I didn't realise when I got this how I hadn't tried it. I just kind of looked at it and thought, oh, that's nice. I didn't really realise how pigmented it is. So, I mean, look at that. That's crazy pigmented. Just for a little lip tint. But you can see it better on my lips. That's all I have on. That little, tiny little bit clear gloss over the top of it. That's it. I love it. I really like it. It's just, it's just so easy to just slap on and go. So that is the lip tint latte. I just think it's really nice, really, really nice. You get a huge amount as well. And my favourite thing, my absolute favourite thing that I've sent um, from the new range uh, is the Luster Body Powder, which I just love. This is £10. I just love this. I have it on today. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to see. It's just this beautiful shimmering gold dust. And all you do is you just take a little bit in your hands, if you'll be able to see like that take a little bit in your hand and you just put it on your body it is and it just it's you wouldn't think a powder would stay like you just wouldn't think it'd stay on its own i don't know if it will show up you can see the shimmer there on my hand like it's just the prettiest thing in the world it's just so pretty i love it i love the fact that it's a powder as well you get 40 grams of this but what i really love about this product is the fact that it smells like flying fox shower gel now that is probably one of my favorite shower gels ever a love flying fox which is of course if you don't know it's jasmine and gardenia so if it's really really heavily jasmine scented and i've actually found that i don't really need to wear a perfume when i have this on and ever since i got it i've been wearing thank you so much for watching i hope that was enjoyable for you um who doesn't like lush right so and um yeah make sure to leave a comment down below and tell me your favorite lush product uh, i would really be interested to find that out because i have so many I don't know what I would be. Probably, probably Flying Fox Shower Gel. And I really like the Comforter. I like the Comforter um, Bubble Bar. And you Snap the Whip um, Body Buffer. I don't know if they make that anymore. I love you Snap the Whip. Yeah, so those are my favourites. So make sure to tell me your favourite Lush product down below in the comments. If you've done a Lush haul, link that down below as a video response. That would be really cool to see. We can never get enough Lush, so I'd really like to see what you've bought recently from Lush. Make sure to subscribe and do that by clicking up here. That means the world to me. And uh, like the video if you like it. That, that means so much to me. Um, I'll leave all my social networking links down below. I'm on Facebook. I'm on Twitter. I'm on Beautylish. I'm on Blog Loving. I will leave them all down below. Drop me a note. Say hi on any one of those, and I'll say hi back. So um, yeah, I hope you have a wonderful day guys and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye everyone.